All right, so I have this face mask on, as you can see. And it probably doesn't work for that. I've been using it for like a week or a week and a half now. And it really that's besides the point. So I'm just here to talk about what today I'm here to talk about, like my relationships in my life right now. Um, uh, I'm a senior, graduating this year, high school. Course, you know, I damn sure doesn't look like anybody does in college. So, ooh, it's not coming here, you guys. <laughs> it's funny here. So, I don't know. I began this year with like two solid friends. No, I, I just had like a supportive friend group. Like, alternating from last year, I had, like, a boyfriend. Uh, like, I just had, like, people who I thought cared about me. And then, like, throughout the summer, it started, like, dwindling off, and I broke up with my boyfriend. And then, so, like, all his friends weren't my friends anymore. I mean, they were never even my friends. They were, like, like I like white guys, so, like, and I live, like, in the country, so, like, most of his friends were, like, rednecks. And I was, like, ooh, and they were, like get that from here, you know, out of here, and I was like, I didn't even do anything, I was just trying to get better love, and I thought, I mean, yeah, he thinks right, anywho, um, it's like, yeah, and then throughout the summer, that, like, kind of went off, and then I still ended up hanging out with my one friend, let's call her Carla, um, I don't know I was I kind of began be like we were like acquaintances during last year and then we kept getting closer because like my other friends and like I am like so many fucking friend groups like that's what I'm saying but like that's just me like I'm able to be friends with a lot of people which is probably why I don't have one significant like one friend group that stays with me forever because I like I'm with everybody like I can get along with everybody so it's probably why nobody likes me now but anywho back then her she was having trouble with her boyfriend and we were always telling her to just leave him because he's like a piece of shit he's not going anywhere like nowhere and like this whole big scandal thing like he robbed somebody for drugs <laughs> and we're in high school and it's fucking weird but anywho so like he went to jail and she was still like um being by his, by his side and stuff, and I was like, yeah, that's cool and all, but, like, I mean, what are you gonna do this whole year, just wait for him? Oh, fuck, I said it again. Fuck, I know you're not good at this. <laughs> Shit. Ooh, that was good, that felt good to get that out. Anywho, um, he went to, like, jail or whatever, or, like, a minor facility or something, I don't fucking know, and so, like, all this shit came up about how he was cheating on her, but, like, before him, like, he had been cheating on her, like, a million times, and, like, he would say he's never gonna do it again, and so fast forward to, like, when she's, I'm, like, I'm there for her every step of the way, trying to help her get over him, like, I would come over, like, every day, almost, like, we spent every, almost every fucking day of the summer with each other, and, like, that's all cool, like, she gets over him, and, like, we hang out, like, all the time, and, like, we were, like, best friends, and, like, we bonded, and I would go over, like, it was just, like, he's, like, the best friend I could say I've had in high school, like, the longest duration of time, probably because it was summer. And then when school starts, everything's hunky dory. Like we're still talking. I'm like, I'm not miss you. Like I'm going over to your house because I play sports and I work. And so like, we never got time to see each other. And now, when my season is like dwindling down, and like whenever we don't, like I'm not busy. Like I'll ask her if she wants to hang out. And she's like, I'm doing something. I have an appointment. I have a dentist appointment. I have a doctor's appointment. But then, like, any other time I see her hanging out with my, like, our other friends. And I'm like, so, like, if you wanted to hang out, like, I know now, if she wanted to hang out with me, she would have said something. But, oh my gosh. 
I love the green. Ooh. Let me do this. Fuck you. <laughs> Sending snaps, you know. Just a casual fuck you. Ha <laughs> ha. It's wrong. Am I supposed to know who are you? It's me, you fucking bitch. Okay. It's me. And let's see what she says to that. Can I just say this? <sighs> I should not have just said nothing. Because you... <sighs> Back to the story time. Getting off track. Yeah, if like people wanted to hang out with me, I guess they would say they wanted to. But like, I don't even annoy... Like, I've been... Like, it seems to me like whenever somebody's going through something... And I'm there for them. Like, I'm the only one there for them. And when they get when they get happy and whatever again, like, they leave me. And, like, do what they gotta do. I was like, I was not a part of the problem. I was trying to help you find a solution. And why are you discarding me like I was a part of the problem? I, like, I don't know what to say to that. Jesus. Fuck. And so, that's one part that's gotten me here with no friends and likely I um, will likely not be having a job because they're taking me on like leave I don't know temporary leave what the fuck is that I literally do everything they say in the job I scrub the legs of the chairs one night I, and they didn't ask anybody else to do it I'm on time I do what people tell me to do I've never complained. I don't start drama. I don't know why they're putting me on leave. Probably. 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 Um, yeah. So basically that's my life right now. Um, I think I may have depression, but... Um, I, I, I feel like I do. I just broke the fully as I had like this big fucking episode about me being ugly. And I was crying and laughing. And then I started talking about killing somebody. And I was like, I could actually get away with it. And now that I'm thinking about But, like, the thing is, I actually forgot about that. So maybe in, like, these psychosis episodes that I have, like, I'll go, like, like crazy. I'll go crazy. Like, my mind is going, like, fucking mani. Like, uh, mania. And then I'll just, like, forget about it. start seeing my therapist again but that's a lot of work because I don't want to make it seem like I feel like there's something wrong with me but then I don't want to make it seem like there's something wrong with me I want people to see me and see that it's that I'm not normal and notice themselves like I don't want to have to make a scene <laughs> and I'm just talking yeah like I don't want to have to make a scene for them to know that something's wrong with me. Like, my mom should know I'm not myself, even when I say. Uh, I actually don't even think my mom knows who I am. She really doesn't know who I am. I'm just somebody living in the house, paying, not paying any rent. Like, <laughs> ew, I hate to call myself. Alright, well, this concludes today's um, vlog, video, whatever, whatever. Um, good night almost christmas time so everybody should start getting their gifts together peace out